Hello, my dear students, and welcome back to my class. And today, the topic of our lesson is the birth of Moses and the beginning of Exodus. Our learning objectives for today is to, to define who Moses was and describe how baby Moses avoided death. Also explain how Moses got inspired by God. And finally, to define the meaning of Exodus. The story of Moses is described in the, in the Old Testament, in the book of Exodus 2. And if we refer to it, the birth of Moses was a biblical story that tells us how Moses was born in Egypt to Hebrew parents who hid him in a basket on the Nile to save him from the Pharaoh's order to kill all newborn Hebrew males. He was born and adopted by the Pharaoh's daughter who raised him in a royal palace. Moses' birth was part of God's plan for free, to free Israelites from slavery in Egypt. So why did Pharaoh order to kill all the Hebrew baby boys? Pharaoh was worried that the Hebrews were becoming too numerous and strong for him and his army to control, and that if it continued to happen, that eventually they would join with the other enemies of Egypt and challenge Pharaoh's army. Moses was adopted by Pharaoh's daughter and raised as a prince. When Moses was out of Egypt in the desert, God appeared in front of him as in the form of the burning bush and inspired him to lead the Israelites out of slavery. Although Moses was the actual leader, Aaron, his brother, acted as his mouth. The two brothers went to the Pharaoh together and it was Aaron who told him to let the Israelites go using his magic rod in order to show the might of God. But Pharaoh was very stubborn and he didn't want to lose his slaves. It was very hard to convince him to let them go. That's why God sent ten plagues on Egypt to make uh, the Pharaoh let people go. So what is Exodus? Exodus uh, means a mass departure of people. If we refer to the Old Testament of the Bible, Exodus stands for the liberation of Israelites from slavery in Egypt.